at this point. We'll start with the Prime Minister, the Honorable Dr. Denzel Llewellyn Douglas. The Oath of Allegiance. I, Dr. Denzel Llewellyn Douglas, do swear. I, Dr. Denzel Llewellyn Douglas, do swear that I will faithfully bear that I will faithfully bear true allegiance to Her Majesty Queen Elizabeth II. True allegiance to Her Majesty Queen Elizabeth II. Her heirs and successors. Her heirs and successors. According to law. According to law. So help me God. So help me God. It's the oath of office. I, Dr. Denzel Llewellyn Douglas, do swear. I, Dr. Denzel Llewellyn Douglas, do swear. That I will honor, uphold, and preserve. That I will honor, preserve, and uphold. The Constitution of St. Christopher and Nevis and the law. The Constitution of St. Christopher and Nevis and the law that I will conscientiously, impartially, and to the best of my ability, that I will conscientiously, impartially, and to the best of my ability, discharge my duties as Prime Minister, discharge my duties as Prime Minister, and do right to all manner of people without fear or favor, affection or ill will, and do right to all manner of people without fear or favor, affection or ill will. So help me God. So help me God. This is the oath of secrecy. I, Dr. Denzel Llewellyn Douglas, do swear. I, Dr. Denzel Llewellyn Douglas, do swear that I will not on any account that I will not on any account at any time whatsoever at any time whatsoever disclose any counsel, advice, opinion, or vote disclose any counsel, advice, opinion, or vote given by any minister as a member of cabinet given by any minister as a minister of the member of cabinet and that I will not accept with the authority of the cabinet and that I will not accept with the authority of the cabinet and to such extent as may be required for the proper conduct of the government of St. Christopher and Nevis as may be required for the proper conduct of the government of St. Christopher and Nevis directly or indirectly reveal the business or proceedings of the cabinet. Directly or indirectly reveal the business or proceedings of the cabinet. Or any matter coming to my knowledge as a member of the cabinet. Or any matter coming to my knowledge as a member of the cabinet. So help me God. So help me God.
Denzel Llewellyn Douglas Esquire. Greeting. By virtue of the power and authority in me vested, by section 52, bracketed 2, of the Constitution of St. Christopher and Nevis, I do hereby appoint you, the said Denzel Llewellyn Douglas, to be a Minister of Government for St. Christopher and Nevis with the powers, rights, privileges, and advantages to the same belonging or appertaining with effect from Saturday, 7th February, Sunday, 7th February, 2010. And I do hereby command all in singular Her Majesty's officers and loving subjects in St. Christopher and Nevis and all others whom it may concern to take due notice hereof and to govern themselves accordingly. Given under my hand and the public seal of St. Christopher and Nevis at Government House, St. Christopher, this 27th day of January 2010, and in the 58th year of Her Majesty's reign, signed Cuthbert M. Sebastian, Governor General. Dr. Denzel Llewellyn Douglas, Prime Minister, Minister of Finance, Sustainable Development, and Human Resource Development. <laughs>